Hey y'all, it's Mudge. I am on my daily walk around the park um, during my lunch break. Um, I am so sorry. I'm so bad at posting on YouTube anymore. Uh, now that I'm back at work, it's been really hard to find time to do things. Um, but I'm gonna try to do better, so I'm just gonna update y'all while I'm walking. So, I've been a little frustrated because <laughs> um, I haven't lost any weight in like two weeks. I'm at 202 and I'm just on the border of getting below 200 pounds and having lost 70 pounds total. And I'm just so frustrated that I haven't lost those three pounds to get me at 199. And it's, I don't know, I'm really mad at myself. So that's one reason I haven't been making any videos this time, plus having no time. But, um, I have lost a few more inches. Um, and I think two around my chest, uh, two, um, on my waist, my thighs are I think one and a half inches smaller and my neck is uh, one inch smaller so that's fun that I'm losing inches at least I just I really am anxious to get below 200 um, my brother and my sister and I are having a contest to see who can get to 190 faster um, so I'm hoping I can win <laughs> Um, but I'm a little, like I said, just frustrated right now. I have been trying new foods. I still can't eat a lot of them. I'm wondering if some of the new foods I'm eating is making it harder to lose weight. I don't know because I'm still like super, super, super keto. Like <laughs> I have no sugars, no fruit, no breads. I am very strictly keto and I eat very small amounts, so I am a little frustrated with being plateaued. I have been working out, and there are a few videos I'll probably hook up um, or put in a separate video again. Um, the, I've been working out, I've been walking, I've been doing all this stuff trying to get into shape. Part of me wants to blame it on overly working out and getting anaerobic and hurting myself. Um, and then, you know, your muscles are sore and they retain water, but I feel like that's not a good excuse for not losing anything in two weeks. I haven't gained anything. I just haven't lost anything. So it's frustrating. Yeah, I know I keep saying that, but I really am. I'm just so frustrated. <laughs> Something that's exciting is that, and I'll, and I'll, like I said, I'll put the videos in. Um, my dresses don't fit, <laughs> so it sucks and it's exciting because I put them on and they're huge on me, but it sucks because I need to get the time to sew them and make them fit. <laughs> um, so just little things. I'm able to put on a dress that I haven't worn in years and it fits better now than it did when I bought it. So that's a win. Um, yeah, also something that we realized is that Papa Murphy's is doing keto breadless or crustless pizzas. And if you eat that with like zoodles, zucchini noodles, it is fantastic. I can only eat a very, very little bit of it before I get extremely full. Like seriously, just a couple bites and then some more, some extra zoodles. Um, and then I'm just overly done. But I wonder if the grease from that could be what's causing me to not lose weight. I'm only eating it a couple times because I always have leftovers. My husband will eat like more than half of it. <laughs> and then I'll just have two little um, small cups of it, one for eating with him, one for eating at work the next day. Um, anyway, doesn't matter. It's probably too greasy and I should probably stop doing that one, even though it's so delicious. 
Um, and then also, I've gotten a little better at meal prepping. I have bought little containers at Walmart uh, that have the split, and then I'll put my little two ounce containers in one side. My little two ounce containers of a vegetable and maybe a little side snack like uh, protein jello. And then my protein protein will go on the other side, like my meat. Like right now I have some pulled pork in the other side. So that is what I'm doing right now. Um, not much of an update. I know I have not been as informative as I've meant to be, but um, this is what's happening in my life. I'm gonna try better on Mondays to make a video. I'm so sorry, y'all. And I thank y'all so much for my new followers. I don't have a lot. I think I have like eight. But I really appreciate any support. It's amazing. Um, if you want, you can also follow me on TikTok. I do update a lot more on there. I have just barely reached over a little over a thousand followers, which surprises me that anybody's interested enough to watch any of that. But I guess it is easier when it's in like one minute increments. But if you want, follow me there. I'm a lot more active on there because like I said, one minute videos are a lot easier to make. I'm going to make a second video like I did last time with a few of my TikToks on it. So you can watch that if you want or not, if you don't. Um, it'll just have a little compilation of my videos that I've made recently. So I'm gonna get working on that. I've gone around the track twice now. So that's a mile. Um, oh, I got a Fitbit. Costco had them on sale. They may still be on sale if you want one. Um, but I've reached a little over my goal. I usually walk four times, but I do want to edit this video, like I said, and get it on YouTube for y'all. So I hope y'all have a good day. If you have any suggestions, please feel free to tell me in the comments. I am happy to answer any questions you might have in the comments. Like I said before, I've lost a total of 67 pounds. I'm just on the edge of having lost 70 and being under 200 pounds. So I'm really excited about that. Um, like this shirt, y'all, used to be so tight on me that it was really uncomfortable to wear while sitting down. And my stupid little pudge would push out and be so tight that I'd have to lift the shirt up and let the pudge hang, which was gross and disgusting. Um, I know I'm not supposed to body shame myself, but it was disgusting. So <laughs> um, I'm really excited that that's gone, that this is actually quite loose to the point where it looks a little ill-fitting too loose. And that's a big win for me. It feels really awesome. Um, so just, yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching, y'all. Y'all are seriously amazing. Bye.